Before I start the vlog, I really wanted to tell you something. I know you guys have been waiting. It's been a while. Um, so this is, ta-da! So this is my silver launch um, with Ana Luisa of my heart necklace. This was originally in gold and it had a little red heart on it. And you guys really, really loved it. Uh, I was very, very happy. Um, but like always, you asked me for a silver version. So I asked Ana Luisa and we decided to make a silver one. So here it is. And I asked you guys, I actually had a lot of input from you guys about which color this necklace should be since the gold one had a red heart between two colors, blue and green. It was pretty overwhelmingly green. So I did decide to go with this green color. It's kind of like this kind of darkish green color. I think it's really, really beautiful. Actually, I really quickly wanted to show you guys. So um, near like the end of me deciding the colors, um, the team sent me samples and this was one of the sample colors. But in the end, I chose like this shade of green because basically like they sent it to me and for a month, I wore both of these out and then I wanted to see like which one I actually ended up just like pulling and taking and wearing more and also which one got more compliments whenever I went out and it was definitely this green color. This was actually the shade of green that you guys said that you really liked in the first place. But anyways, see, yeah, I thought it was like kind of cool to show you um, a little bit of the process, I guess. And then I also want to show you the um, gold heart necklace, comparing it to the silver, so hold on. Okay, as you can see, this is the silver necklace. And then this one is the gold necklace. Oh, the gold is so pretty too. And then the backs are still the same. They're both like a puffed heart. It's a really pretty kind of like soft heart look. And then again, here are the toggle clasps. It's hard to say toggle clasps. They're exactly the same, but yeah. So the necklace is made of rhodium plated brass. And then this part is colored cubic zirconia. I love this necklace cause it's just really, really easy to put on, but it's just like the gold version. So basically like it has a little toggle clasp. I'm trying to show you, but it goes like this. Like, look how pretty that is. I feel like it's such a good kind of, just like adds to the color of your outfit without being too in your face, you know? So this is gonna be $75 in USD. But if you're shopping internationally, the price is gonna look different because it's gonna be in your currency. And then for shipping, they have domestic shipping and that's gonna be like three to five days and it's USPS first class and I don't think there's like a minimum order. And then they also do USPS priority and that's gonna take like one to three days, but I believe that's like $4.99. Whereas if you just did the three to five days, so the USPS first class mail, then that's just free. And then if you're international, if your order is $125 and up, then you can get free shipping I think it's like through DHL but anyways um thank you so much for all the support that you guys have given me on not even like the heart necklace but like my dagger earrings and stuff like that it really really does mean a lot to me and it makes me so happy when I like see you guys wearing my stuff and it's very comforting to know that like the things that I like other people like too I don't know if that makes sense so I really appreciate you guys supporting me and buying and wearing the pieces it means a lot to me but anyways um, I'm gonna leave a link to the necklace you guys can shop it down below and if you're curious about the other pieces I made that will also be down below as well but yeah uh, thank you again and I hope you guys love it we are on our way to uh, hair studio. They come in here. yeah so basically today we're doing our uh, engagement photo shoot in Korea they have like a lot of studios that people go to where they like rent wedding dresses which is what I showed you guys they rent wedding dresses to do engagement shoot shoots anyways so but we have to get like our hair and makeup done first so that's where we're going now Jimmy's got to fix this little little hair so do I So 
up, this is my makeup. I asked for something really natural, but I was too scared to like vlog the process because she was very in the moment with the makeup and I felt bad. I didn't want to like vlog and interrupt her. But I think they're gonna do my hair now um, and like dress and stuff. It's a very long process. But I saw some like famous people pictures on the wall. So I think like um, celebrities come here and get their makeup done. Uh, today we are in Songsu, just walking around, and there's this store that I've always wanted to like, kind of go into. It kind of reminds me of like New York. This just this particular store. There's this cafe that looks really like artsy that we saw while we after lunch. And so we just decided to come in and get a coffee. Last night we went out and I only slept like two hours last night, so I'm really tired. I'm barely alive. I had to drag his butt all the way home. His drunk little butt all the way home. <laughs> We stumbled upon this street with like a ton of just stalls. We just wanted to like explore a little bit outside of the area we were just in because we had been there before already. Um, so we're not really sure what's over here. Yeah. And we're not that hungry, but it does smell good. That's the problem. It's like I feel like every time we explore, it's really nice, but it's just coffee shops and food or like yeah. shopping. And, and we only have so much stomach we to fill. So much stomach, we only have so much money. <laughs> Ending our date because we're so tired at this cafe <laughs> and the tart is a lot bigger than we thought it was gonna be. So for Chuseok, we're just um, taking this little day trip um, to Chuncheon and we're at this cafe on the way there called Hebak. and the weather's like pretty nice today and we're trying to like go kayaking there with Haku so we'll see how that goes but we're stopping by to get a little grub.
basically while I was on the tubing, like I felt like a crack in my thumb or something. And um, I thought I broke it, but I just went to the doctor and I didn't break it, any bones, but it's like pretty painful. He looked kind of confused um, and said like it might be a sprain. So he just gave me this, like he was confused why I was in pain. And I was like, anyway, so they just gave me this and they did a little like chirotherapy on my thumb. So we'll see how it goes, but dude, I just went outside and I just freaking got bit like, Look at this. Can you see these? Because I had to walk Haku for his nighttime walk. He's not even he's not even upset or worried about me. I'm watching this drama with Joy, and it's called Once Upon a Small Town. It's very feel good, I like it. But I also kind of want to cut my bangs because it looks so cute in them. I know I'm gonna regret this, but whatever. I have this cute mirror. I'm so confused. I saw this thing on TikTok where I'm supposed to like drag this over this way and then like go like this, but like, hmm, it doesn't look right. Okay, so I didn't do the rest of my hair because it's nighttime, um, but I did like style my bangs just a little. I like dried them, but I don't think I did too bad, even though I had that little mishap in the middle. Pretty good, I shall say, or I'd say.